Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. Let's play some more Rogue Lance. It's time to be a Siren, time to play some Maya. Again, still have yet to win on Maya, but I'm gathering more and more and more knowledge in each and every run, and Maya being so, like, simple and good, uh, I, I I feel like I should, I should I should be getting a win with her. Um, She doesn't really have, like, the absolute most broken skills. How about that? How about this Torment, though? It looks pretty sick. Uh, I mean, Cloud Kill is really, really good, but for how long? Let's, a, a Bushwhack is good. Now, in my last Salvador run, uh, we we actually lost in Tier 2 twice, but we, we figured out a good way to get Salvador cooking in the early game. Now, for me, in Maya, it's been mostly... I go right side to right, we need a grenade and a relic. Whatever, it doesn't really matter what they are, as long as I got one. Man, which one of these just hits the... Kicks the bucket? Well, I guess we don't... We'll never need corrosive and fire. So let's just... Keep the corrosive on the back burner for now. Five points. I almost always go... Foresight to get down this tree faster. But I, I kind of want to try accelerate... It's 15% gun damage and 20% bullet speed. But I... This is mag size and reload speed. It's just... It, it shows up so much of what other characters struggle with. So we're gonna go it. Now, I just got done guns working a whole bunch, so you have to forgive me. If, I, if it takes me a second to readjust here. Put them up. Okay, that's fine. Of course, the two enemies that I see first are got these giant shields. That's okay, though. Later, kid. Nice. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Who's on top of me? Ironclad lunatic. You know what, brother? I don't... I'm not against hot swapping on the fly. And I, I think you should be, but... You didn't plan. You didn't plan ahead, and that's your fault. Pathetic. <laughs> no, but really. Pathetic. I already have it. Let's just drop it while we're here. Oh, you don't have a shield. That's unlucky. You guys gotta chill out over there, huh? Apparently. Oh, wow. See ya. No shield means get killed. You guys noticed, have you guys played Krieg and noticed that his, this might be even easier. Have you noticed that he, his, uh, his head, that's his pirate head, it's named Keel Hall, your infants. A Keel Hall is like something that pirates say, or it's like, I know it's like a nautical term, but having a skin named Keel Hall, your infants is, is, yeah, that's pretty rough. Okay, you go up. Which means I can then just rinse you with headshots. You're a heartbreaker, dream taker. See you later, homie. Maya's really good with sniper rifles as well. So, makes it fairly easy to get done. We gotta get done. Later. That's gonna be a good grenade for just overall deeps. Watch, only one second fuse time as well means it breaks pretty quickly. Dro drops his shield, and then I can kill him. Alright, do you got a shield? No shield. <laughs> Later, kid. Alright, let's farm this stage out as quickly as we possibly can. Let's go. Now, down down here somewhere is a pressure plate. I know, right, right there. Let's get the pressure plate first. Hmm. Man, that's tough. I think a phobia. And a gospel, but... I mean, this, this sniper's already doing better for me. I feel like... I feel like as far as... When it, when it comes to unique weapons... Vladov snipers are... The creme de la creme. I mean, the, with the Drew being the number, number one... Let's take Helios. Let's keep it simple. Let's go down the ruin. I think if I had to give you guys my 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 non-uniques tier list, I think it's Droog 1, 
quad two. Anarchist might be three. You know, of course, there's the there's the top Nia as well to throw in there to add to the discussion. But but yeah, it, the but if you had to give me like if you what manufacturer slash weapon type combo do you trust the most in combat? For me personally, number one is Vladov snipers. They are the most consistent. It feels like no matter which one you get, they're all good. Now, that being said, I prefer... Obviously, prefer the Droog, but... In the past, I would have told you, like, Jacob's shotguns, Jacob's pistols, and things of that nature, but... Not anymore. Not anymore. What's our current relic? Resistances? Yeah, let's take a Vitality Relic, sure. Boo doo doo Boo doo doo all right, one more, I think. I think this is already taken. I already opened up this one. Yeah, all right, let's head out. Maybe, unless there's one over. Yes, okay, okay. Proto shields? Nope. Now, a rough rider would be nice on uh, Maya because then I can get to that, whatever that bunny skill is. Oh, you go up, which means that you also go down. Okay, that singularity. What's that fuse time? 1.3. Okay. Don't touch me. Don't touch me, I'm sterile. Later. Alright, let's get this. What did you drop me? Hyperion and... Oh, 41% cooldown, right? That's large. That'd be large. And uh, you know what? A little bit in charge as well. See you later, kiddo. Let's see. Come on. Land some headshots. Land some headshots. Uh, dang, these guys are so hard to headshot. They're oh, constantly moving around. And their, their crit spots are so tiny. Come on. Land one. Oh, he's gone. He spread his Helios to his buddy. Hmm. But you weren't expecting that. I bet you weren't expecting this. Emperor's new groove, all time. All timer. Okay, you guys ready for this? This is my my animated Disney slash Pixar tier list. You guys ready? Number. Okay, I gotta think. Uh, give me a second to think. Okay, the one that I can watch all the time. And never really get bored of. Ratatouille is uh, is really up there, but Encanto for me. Encanto might take the cake. The music in Encanto. Okay, here we go. This it's gonna be. Okay, how about this? Let's just do Disney princess movies, okay? And this is a no in no certain order. It goes. Ah. Uh, Angled, Moana, and Kanto. Those are my top three. Change my mind. With, I'm gonna put. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna put Tangled at number one, and Kanto at number two, and uh, Moana at number three. Feel free to tell me that I'm wrong about those. Uh, Long Rider, FaceTime, TMP. We have a Snyder now, which is nice for shields. I open up. Gatling gun? I typically would like to do Gatling gun shenanigans, but this time I'm, I'm kind of moving on without it. Let's do Cloud Kill and Chain Reaction. This is my, this is my build. I, I, I like this build. This is the build that I went in my first ever Borderlands playthrough, basically, so... Oh, definitely gonna want just straight up fire damage here. You're not gonna be seeing any shields. All right, let's see if we can crit this guy. No, we didn't get land any crits. That's tough. What do we got? But the cloud kill did a number on him. Holy cow! Huge. Oh, another rabbit skag. Go up. You know what happens after you go up? You go down. 
Make sure we open up these chests along the way. I'm double. I'm down. I'm. I'm, I'm done. Double. Double one back. Do you guys see how much damage that did? What's my What's my class mod now? Can easily get replaced easily. Like fire rate. Fire rate and is it? What else is a buff? Some pretty trash stuff, but the connect reflection is good, and the fire rate is good. Getting 31% fire rate is a is a ridiculously good thing. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna take a cat class mod, but I'm gonna take the 108. Um. I'm gonna take it just in case. If we get something that's like a sandhawk or you know whatever the unique is, I'm gonna want to have a cat class mod. I know that I'm not running SMGs right now, but I might in the future. You're a heartbreaker. Okay, the rubberized are typically not my favorite, but I'm, they're starting to grow on me a little bit more. They're simple. You throw them at the enemy. They blow up instantly. Come back in. Come back in here, brother. Later. Oh, there's a green... Oh, there's not a green power-up. Dang. Longbow Crosa Transfusion with a 0, 0.0 second fuse time? What? Holy, brother. That's nice. Oh, I need to kill that loot enemy. What'd you give me? Is that a gub? Oh, it's a hornet. Nice. Okay, we are set for Crosa damage. Cloud kill plus hornets. Please give us Saturn or Uranus. Please. Okay, you need to go up. <laughs> Later, kid. <laughs> that was funny. All right, five points. We're going to keep going. Reaper me. Crouch. We're on. Let's see. A muckamuck. I do like the muckamuck. But... Pick a presence, but we're going to keep going. The muckamuck is, a really, is the highest damage Jacob sniper. Non-unique. I'm not sure if there's one that's higher that is unique. Take that. <laughs> we're, f we're doing pretty good here. This this Vladov sniper is kind of carrying us through these early, early zones. No sustain. Well, we do have some sustain. We got a 0, 0.0 second longbow fuse time transfusion grenade, which is more more sustain than we have in a lot of our runs look at all these nurse class mods oh already my homie okay he's gone hey okay, let's just back up for a second later kid if they want to close the gap on me that's their prerogative there we go get that one down there as well you seem to be absolutely fine here Later. Doom, 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 doom. No need to put him up. It's an easy kill. Maya makes the zone pretty simple. We're gonna take Bomber. Ow. Okay. Let's back up a little bit. Keep it simple. Keep it simple. I see a legendary right there from our loot enemy that we killed. Nice. What is it? It's a Varuk. I like the Varuk. First, I want to take somebody out with this Snyder. I do like the Varuk. We're going to equip it. It's a doll assault rifle. It's pretty fun. Multiple pellets. Okay. And it's, it should be pretty fairly accurate. Let's do some tires, though. This one. Run over here. Two. Wait, where, where are you at? Don't take bomber. Not cool, bro. Later. The Varuk is also nice when shot from the hip. That's something I like about it. It's, it's good from the hip and from name down sights. The bomber's gotta go. Pick out those bombers and everything else comes into place. 
Huge. The Veruca Sarko is one of my favorites. It is. I get a little bit closer before we fire it. Nice. Okay. <laughs> you did that to yourself, homie. I had nothing to do with that. We got this. Okay. Not bad. He's not doing that much damage. And a 41% cooldown means we get him back into our, our zone of control here. An angry Veritas. Oh, should we, should we at least try it? I know it, it matches a shield, right? There's a certain shield that goes with it. But I'm not entirely sure. I already have a zero point. Ooh. No, we're fine. All right. So, one point chain reaction. Now, this is the one I like to take extra points into flicker. And then next time, take a point into cataclysm. Oh, I didn't get it. Okay, sick, sick. This is an this is an enemy that I can kill with um with corrosion damage. That's for sure. Horn at me. Let's go. You go right there. With cloud kill, with chain reaction, this should be a pretty easy fight. As long as that missile doesn't hit me. Plus this. It's about as easy as I could if I could have asked for her. Yes. Get the keep the cloud kill going. So easy. Maya absolutely rips apart uh, armor bosses. Probably fastest of any character in the game. A juicy ravager with a Jacob's um grip. Oh, another Varuk. Oh, attack Varuk. Oh, well, don't mind if I do, brother. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. It's slagged up. It's all slagged up. Okay, let's see. A Bone Shredder, an Elephant Gun, a Judge, a Triketra, a Twister, and a Pot... The Twister's got... The Twister's definitely got some work to do to get back into my good graces. I'll take it for now, but it's got some work to do, that's for sure. Um, With a Bone Shredder, I think it might be time. This is the kind of weapon that you, you pivot for. Now, we take a point into Ruin. And I think... I think we take a point into Mind's Eye, just to, just to say so, and then accelerate. All right. Now, unfortunately, there's no raid bosses with with the armor, which is which is a sad thing, but we are going to be just fine. Let's do. Yeah, I want it. Please be a plasma caster, homie. You and your malocos. Okay. You've already dropped below the amount. I want, I want at least one pull at the box. B shield. Striker in a madhouse. I hate you. <laughs> That's fine. Let's do some wham bam. A little bit of wham bam. I'm not afraid, bro. It's just not power P. I haven't gotten Terramorphous in three and a half years. It's been literally been this guy. And this laddie and Power Pete, like the last several videos. All right, slag him, bag him. There we go. Reload me. I, I wish I had a little bit more fire rate, but it is what it is for now. Not bad, deeps. Yeah, honestly, not bad deeps at all. Oh, he's gonna pop up right there. Wherever the sand is starting to... The sand starting to form. Luckily, this weapon's bandit, so I can always just... Here we go. 
I need to get a reload off so this guy doesn't evolve. Oh, he got out. Dang it. Let's come right away. I don't want that incinerator out here. There we go. Dang it. Another one spawned. That's okay. Focus the boss down for a bit. Yeah, that's invulnerability, I think. Yep. No, 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 no. There we go. Don't knock me off the edge, though. That would not be very nice. Toss a... I need to toss a transfusion out. No, they didn't get to me. Dang, that sucks. I'm fine, though. Toss another one. What's nice about it is that it's instant. They're gonna go find somebody, and they'll come back and heal me. Oh, we're, we're zoned in. Let's go. You guys see the way that, that behaved, though? When it finds a target, is it... That's, that's kind of cool. Let's slag him up. This is doing a lot of damage to Crawl. I'm confident. Yep. No loot enemies, though. We're letting a lot of enemies spawn. Not a whole lot of loot enemies. See ya. Ruin is so OP. It slags everything in the game. Come on, give me that before. Oh, come on, I can't get into it. I can't get in there. I'm not near the center of the stage at all. I would like to be, but I just can't. Okay, can I please get this now? Thank you. Oh, and now you're towards, brother. Come on down. All right, look around real quick. I don't see anything of uh, that big of value. That's okay. There's, I see a purple. A couple purples. But that's all I see. Okay. Let's go look at some chests then instead. Let's see. I was going to say, uh, I have a pretty high... Percentage cat class mod right now, so. We're bowling. Let's see. SMG damage plus 35%. Cooldown rate plus 43%. I think the cooldown rate is going to be a little bit more effective than the SMG gun damage. That's just me, though. Phase lock does so much for us. It applies slag, which will double our damage rather than just increasing our gun damage by 35%. Especially when our gun damage is already at 108% plus... Oh, let's go. Plus... Um, accelerate gun damage. So, like, our gun damage is, is really, really high. On top of that, we have a Reaper gun damage. So, like, we have a lot of gun damage already. We don't need to be stacking any more gun damage when we can be getting something like cooldown reduction. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no reason for it. Okay. We have tons and tons and tons of gun damage. What we do not have is elemental. That's one big damage multiplier that we're missing out on. But the bone shooter kind of makes up for it with its, its pretty high base damage and multiple pellets. Right? Three pellets per shot. Not sick, nasty. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Jump. And if we get if we get stuck with robots, we can always just swap over to a hornet. If we even have to. I cannot believe. I cannot believe I actually fell off this parkour course. It was my first time ever falling off it. I think. Right, let's crawl down though. Jump me. Thank you. Jump across. Easy money. Let's not mess this one up. Let's focus up. I can't how am I almost failing? Okay. Bruh. Thank God. Difficulty tier two? Easy. Easy money sauce. The dust. It's time to go to the dust. Okay. 
Okay. Now, my own negative that I just got. It's rubberized, it's incendiary. It's times eight, mine's times six. Let's slap it on, but let's make sure that our other one is not trash. It's actually starred. And let's drop up a whole bunch of stuff that we're never going to use. So that shield, all these grenades. Both these class mods. We keep the fire rate one. These relics can all go. Um, the, the twister, it can stay for now. But again, it's got a lot of work to do before it. I dropped the Triketra, whatever, don't care about it. You only hate me because you ain't me. A couple of Arooks. Nice. Do -do -do. Let's go Hornets. And let's go Horror Show. I don't know. See you later, items. Don't need you anymore, apparently. All right. Hmm. Heroes Pass. I wonder what's. Oh, this is this is a tough map. All right. See you later. I open you up. Especially when there's a uh, sort of badass around here. But good news is we got Cloud Kill. Let's toss a couple of negatives out. We stay on this guy. Don't let him breathe. Oh no. I'm in trouble. Toss a couple of negatives. Ah, dang it. Kill this letty. See ya. Oh, we put him up. Nice. Okay. G G to that guy. I'm on fire. I am on fire. Yeah, with decreased SMG accuracy, it's a little bit rough. Oh, see ya. Not bad. Hmm. Honestly, I don't see a point in rocking the O negative if, if this transfusion is longbow and it can heal us from far away. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That doesn't seem very fair. Cloud kill, help us out here. Thank you. Okay, he's gonna go down. Chain reaction is gonna help me out as well here. Thank you, Cloud kill. Doom, 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 doom. Get the Cloud kill on him. Let it stack up. Oh, juke, 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 juke. Oh, now I'm closing the gap. What are you going to do now, brother? He's going to bash. He's going to bash. Oh, I dodged, the, I dodged the attack. Get close again. And then back up. The instructors are so easy. Get close again. And then back up. Oh, I got them all figured out now. Later, kid. You actually, it's they're actually pretty funny to fight once you if you uh, incorporate that strategy. All right, accelerate and suspension. Let's go. Ah. Okay, still haven't gotten any legendary class mods or anything like that, but this bone shredder is doing okay for us. Don't see reason to stop using it for now. Our cloud kill is massive for us. Yeah, see how we don't do that much damage until our cloud kill comes off cooldown, and then once it goes, once it comes back, we actually start doing a bunch. Kind of, it's kind of insane to be honest with you. Later. We'll farm while we while we fight here. You don't want that work. Trust me. You should have just gone back to where you came from. So this wasn't your fight. I'm trying to clear out these robots so that you guys can live a happy life on this planet, but instead you want to attack me? Big mistake. Do I have any survivor? Do I have any of my viewers watch Survivor? Because I'm a big Survivor fan. 
Now, I haven't watched the episode from this past Wednesday yet. I'm going to be watching it tonight. I typically watch on Thursdays. No ads. Um, but if I can catch it live, I do like to catch it live. But this season's pretty lit. Alright, five points, me. You're right about that. There is always more to learn. Let's do some sweet release. One point... One point into Rex. That way we can make use of all these bonus skills. So reckon Rex and Sweet Release are nice because when you when you put somebody up in the phase lock, then you get a whole bunch of um, a fire rate, and when they die, you get heals. So it's really nice for mobbing. Not the greatest for bossing, and that seems seems to be my thing with Maya. She's really great for mobbing and taking out you know medium size enemies. Um, that's a nice that's a nice thing to get. She's really nice at taking out medium-sized enemies once that she can phase lock. But if, so if it's someone she can't phase lock, she tends to struggle a little bit more. Now, let's take that bandit launcher. Almost ran by it. It was an upgrade in all slots and an upgrade uh, by manufacturer because I like bandit launchers the best. Those large magazine sizes, you know. All right, th that's the breakneck banshee. But it doesn't have backdraft. That's what I'm looking for. Plus six fleet or plus six backdraft, plus five fleet. Class mod with a love thumper. That could be good. Alright. Give me a second, guys. I'll be right over there. I'll be right I'll be right with you. Alright. There we go. So you guys saw how I got a whole bunch of fire right there. That's a big reason why. She she feels pretty nice to mob with. Well, let's put somebody up and then use that fire rate to kill other people. He's, good. He's definitely going to evolve. Not, not strong enough, brother. I put this guy up. Don't let that buzzer get... Don't even let that buzzer get off the ground. There we go. Sweet release me, sweet release me. Why am I running out into the open? Somebody want to explain to me why I'm running out in the open? There we go. See ya. Go down, homie. Thank you. Come again. Hoida, hoida. I can't jump over there. <laughs> Down this, Maya is so much fun. I have a great time playing this character. Tell me, I'll tell you what. All right, uh, let's see. Um, let's go into. Let's 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 clean this up a little bit. There we go. It's a little bit cleaned up. We got wreck and sweet release both maxed out now. Not my favorite two skills in the whole world because they're so dependent on having phase lock up. But, oh, that's better. What's mine? Plus six. Okay, let's do it. That's nice. Backdraft and fleet. That's the one I'm looking for. Okay, okay, okay. If we get a love thumper, if we get a love thumper or a punchy or a rapier or... Let's take that. Or it... Even better, say, a slag-bladed ruby. I'm gonna try it. Melee Maya. The Melee Maya pivot for 5k YouTube views? <laughs> no. Kidding. Kidding! Relax. You'll never get that many! Chill out. We know. Alright. Come on, homie. What do you got? Probably nothing, to be honest with you. I'm going to use the wreck. And then I come back to you for the sweet release. That seems to... that That's probably the most optimal way to do it. Is you put up somebody. And then you use, you use the fire rate to eliminate other people. And then come back to the original target. I have a question about chain reaction. When you have an enemy phase locked, all of your shots that hit enemies have a chance to ricochet and hit other nearby enemies. It only works with bullets. Got it. So if I phase lock somebody, I don't. Ha it's not just the the phase locked enemy. Can I maybe get some health back here? Thank you. 
It's not just the phase locked enemy that um, ricochets. It's also enemies around. So I can kill someone that is phase locked by killing an enemy near them that isn't phase locked. Good to know. Now shoot the first radio here. I, I'm, I'm really liking this bone shredder. A little bit of ricochet for me. Thank you. Instead of Raider Clinton, you made your way to me. I understand that you're not happy. But this right here is what she's really good at. She's really good at these, these mini boss rounds where you can just put them up and put them down. Like, that's like her specialty. Ow. Brother. Now, while well, Sal is probably like the best at like absolutely killing out raid bosses or maybe even Gage and stuff like that. No one's really touching Maya when it comes to these medium, medium damage enemies. Okay. Don't guess to be careful crossing this bridge. Still got one radio to to go find. It's right there. It's not, don't worry, I'm not catching those with my eyeballs now. I just know where they all are. Do do. It's what happens when you play. It's not worth it to, to come over here and open this, but maybe I'll get a loot tank. No. I'm gonna become I'm, I'm gonna become a master of Borderlands 2 by playing this game. Like everyone else had to like grind, you know, years of playing this game to understand a lot of his concepts. I mean, I know that I don't know everything about the game. I'm I'm never gonna know as much as some other people. But I am learning a lot. Um This is six That's mod two, to be honest with you. Alright, let's go suspension. Converge. And ward. Is there a chest over there? I don't see one. Looking down. Didn't see one. Another. Another Ravager. Another. I believe that's a Torg grip. The Torg has big holes, and the Hyperion has little holes. Sometimes it's hard to tell which is which. Okay, we're heading into the boss section of, of Phase 2. Come on, homie. Dude, he is not happy. This guy. That's a good chunk of his health already. Now, if I can somehow find a way to put somebody else up. Holy cow, we're wrecking this dude. Yeah, I think we got the damage. I think we have the damage. If we're going to be killing Golden Golem this quick, I think we got the damage. Let's get a kill skill. I'm not sure how many kill skills I actually have. Do I even have any kill skills? I don't think so, honestly. I kind of I try to stay away from kill skills as much as possible, but kill skills, a lot of them are like some of the most powerful in the game. A Bane, a Julane, a Teapot. I mean, we take the Fire to the Terramorphos. That's the only one we're taking. Okay. What do I roll? What do I roll? What do I roll? 15. Honestly, I would say 15 is probably the sixth best dice roll on a D20-sided a D dice. Okay. Oh, nice. A legendary Siren class mod. Let's go. Almost missed that. I, I don't always come up here. Okay. Nice. Impaler or Cradle? I'll take an Impaler, but do I really want to even use it? Yeah, I do. Okay. Now. Let's take Ward and Quicken. Okay. Now the question is going to be what what raid boss are we going to get? I really hope it's not Pyrapeat, man. Hmm, trash. What do you got for me? Nothing? That's, no, that's fine. Don't worry about it. Two gubs. 
One of those is a B shield, right? Yeah, it is. We take we take B shield. Come on now. That looks good. Yeah, nuke him. Take a nuke him. Okay. No, it's okay, bro. Um. Good. And pistol me. Something easy. Something easy. Something easy. Okay, Terramorphist. I don't know how easy this is going to be for me, but... We got a B shield. We should be able to pump out some deeps with our Bone Shredder here. Question is, which which one of these is better? This one gives us how much gun damage? 35 plus... 35 plus 15 is 48. This one gives us... 48. A, a lot of cooldown rate as well. Whereas this one gives us 108. So that's 60 more gun damage. But a lot less accuracy. I feel like Legendary Siren might be better than Legendary... Or better than uh, Cat. But I, I could be wrong there. Okay, we don't have a long time for our B-Shield, probably. We're going to have to be kind of quick. And do not be stingy with our grenades. Just throw those bad boys. Okay, that's with the B shield. That's not so bad. Get a reload off. Okay, he hit me. Not cool, man. Almost got killed right there. Didn't even realize. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Be shield, come on. Dude, you take forever, be shield. That's really not bad at all. I need to toss, I need to toss a grenade out this time. Please don't swipe again. Dude, why are you swiping twice? That's the one thing about Terra that I'll never understand. Why this dude swipes twice every once in a while. Oh, I'm dead. Dude, Terra just... He's the random swipe twice, or... And to be honest... That B-Shield... That B-Shield Bone Crusher, or whatever it is, combo was not doing all that much damage. Anyways, that was a pretty fun run. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. See you in the next one. Bye!